Glenn Tipton. What else can you say? I feel horrible for him. My aunt has Parkinson's. This is not a disease that's like, dude, you can power through this. No, you're done. Once you're diagnosed, you're, you're, it's just a downhill from there. So he's trying to back out before he's like, because already he's showing this and dementia, which everybody's again. It's sure weird how everybody's coming down at this now. I swear, and I'm not a conspiracy theorist, that it's got to be something to do with vaccines or something. I don't know. Maybe I, I know I'm crazy. I'm not. Maybe I'm crazy. I know I am. But uh, I, I, I feel horrible for Glenn. KK got out because he was going to be 70. He is 70. He's not coming back. He can't. And he doesn't need the money. He doesn't care. He's not. Uh, he's not greedy like Paul and Jean. This is a totally different thing. And Judas Priest should go on with the blessings of the other members like they have. They've gone through, what, three, four drummers? Uh, this uh, Rob is the second singer. So, uh, you know, this isn't the, you know, but it is the band that everybody knows. So... <laughs> I'm just going to play a few Judas Priest songs. I, um, I don't know any. I only learned one back in 85. Uh, breaking the... Not Breaking the Law. Living After Midnight, because that was a one that everybody liked, and it was happy and all that crap. And, uh... <laughs> read the lyrics. Especially Hot Rocket. Woo, doggy. But it's funny now. You know, joke's on us. <laughs> Uh, I love Rob Alford. I've met a couple times. Nicest guy in the world. Just unbelievably nice. And just, I was going to say sweet. He is a sweetheart, though. He, he cares about people. He cares about the fans. And, uh, you know, this is killing him, too. This is his buddy. So, I'm just going to play bits of a few songs that I think I can play. I don't know them. I've never played them except for the one and it's been 30 years or so. 85, 95, 95, 2005, 2005, 30 something years. Ready? Let's start by playing the first song that I ever learned. And this is what made me go to Randy Rhodes from Joe over at Larry Larson's. He wouldn't teach me Genocide by Judas Priest. He couldn't. He's a jazz guitar player. So I went to Randy. I said, could you teach me? He teach me. He taught it to me. And he goes, you know, your rhythm's really good. We should learn. You should work on your lead. And then he taught me that lick. Which you all know, right? <laughs> That's the lick. Okay, so here's the song. <laughs> Thank you. 